I was mindlessly scrolling through Instagram the other day and I got sucked into one of those ads. I mean, it was for nail polish or some fancy nail kit. I've been seeing a bunch of those. I'm sure every company knows that we're all struggling without going to a nail salon. So I ordered one. I've been working from home and earlier this week, I asked viewers, what service do you miss the most? Mainly women. And it was a toss up between hair and nails. But in this quarantine life, when you've got nothing else to do, I thought I'd jazz them up. This nail kit is from Olive and June. It comes with a nail polish, top coat, and we'll call it nail art, AKA stickers. So I could have gone with a more elaborate kit, but it seemed to get kind of complicated. And it took a couple of weeks to get in. They told me that when I purchased them online because of the whole pandemic. Don't mind that cut. When it comes to nails, I go a little more natural. I've got a lot of other things to upkeep, so these tend to take a back seat. The company promises the polish is easy to apply and lasts a long time. Now, I haven't done my nails for 15 years, so let's see if it works. That was more nerve wracking than I thought. Okay, so I have a secret. I haven't done this in 15 years, so I messed up a couple of them. Luckily, I have nail polish remover, so I'm not giving up on it, but I definitely need another coat. Now we're getting somewhere. Before you paint your nails, how about, I don't know, opening the stickers first? This is not easy. Some of the other kits included tools. Probably could have used one of those. But the toothpick came in handy to clean up and apply the stickers, other than the fact that my husband commented and said my nails look like a teenage girl. That is a reflection on my choices and not the polish. I found that it was really easy to work with. Um, yeah, so it got a little tacky pretty quickly, but no bubbles, no streaks, any, any issues was user error. I cannot wait for nail salons to open back up again.